When I get to the top, I'm going to be a king. Sort of, actually, because I'm supposed to build a castle. Um, come on. Um, I need to make a melon farm, like ASAP, because I need to get... I need to f have enough melons. I need to grow more melons. I can't just use these melons. Um, any of this stuff grow? Nope. That's okay. That's okay. I almost fell in this again. Do I have any more dirt to cover it with? No. Cover it with cobble. I just really don't want to fall and die in here, because that would be so sad. That's just perfect. Okay. So... How do melons work? Melon seeds, you plant the melon seeds. You till, you don't... And you plant the seeds, and then... They, like, grow up, and then they grow on either side of the thing, I think. I think that's how it works. So... I gotta wait a while, because, of course... Gonna wait a little while. Uh, and then maybe I'll have some melons over there. So what else can I do? Well, I can... I can... I can fish more, because I am gonna need more food. Before I get melons, I'm gonna need more food. This bread, this wheat isn't growing as fast as I wanted. So... We can do a little more fishing, and I think I want to light up a lot and maybe build a perimeter, like build a fence. Oh, I should get some fence. I should have gotten some fences, because I could have built, like, a safe perimeter to work in. Maybe if I have to go under one more night, I think I'll do that. I think I'll grab some fences. Um, just so that I cannot have to, like, go hide every night, go back into the cave, because I really don't need anything else from the cave anymore. I think I'm good from the cave. I think what I need to do is just get food, grow my bread, catch some fish, raise some melons. Uh, I should do pump. Can I, can you eat pumpkins? You can make pumpkin pie, which I also don't know how to do. So that's not really that useful. Um, but come on fish. Seriously. This is boring. I need some better bait. That would actually be a cool mechanic if you could make, like, lures. Like, if you... That's probably a mod. But, like, if you took feathers and you could, like, tie flies with the feathers. Or, like, dye, and, like, dye a different colors to make, to make fishing lures. That would be fantastic. I would love that. I would love that. That's probably a mod. That's probably in, um... That's probably in Lost in the Woods already. Life in the Woods. Life in the Woods. Um... That would be fun. Okay, fish. Okay, fish, come on. I guess you're, you're supposed to enchant your fishing rods, really. I missed him! I missed him! Uh, okay, let's cook the salmon. Those sheep always scare me. I guess I could get some more... Some more grass? Some more seeds? I mean, the seeds... Well, I'll get enough to... Maybe not. I don't want to kill any chickens for feathers. Because you're not supposed to kill stuff. Um, let me light up this area. Oh, I got some fences. Not enough, but some. Um, oh, a button. That's useful. Totally. Okay, let me make a ton of torches. So many torches. This is actually really silly. But... I don't want any mobs anywhere near me. No thanks. No mobs for sword fish. Um, this is going to be like so overkill with the torches. But I don't know exactly how far apart you should place torches to make something mob proof. So I'm just going to go nuts. I'm just going to go absolutely Absolutely buck wild with torch placement. They have to be even though. They have to be an even rose. Come on, even rose, even rose. Very nice. Um, just to make absolutely sure 
that I don't get anybody up here that I don't want. And it's possible I'm still going to leave some gaps. And you know what? It's my own fault, and that's fine. Nice field of torch flowers over there now. Basically, that's kind of what that looks like. Yeah, it really looks like a field of torch flowers. Okay. Um, this is feeling safe. On to the next ones. I'm feeling safe right now. There's a lot of sunflowers. I'm going to have to use them for some decoration of my castle. Oh, zombies. That uh, That's a spawner, I believe. Maybe not, because I've been here for a little while. If you didn't know, this is a thing I learned from... I, I mentioned it in my last season, but... Um, If you, that's a cave, okay. And that's had time to generate. If you go over newly generated terrain, like brand new terrain that you've never, um, never been to before, and you hear mobs underground, that means that there's a spawner. Because the mobs, um, when, when the spawner like initializes, it, it spawns mobs there. If it wasn't a spawner, um, then it would, they would, the mobs would spawn after like a few minutes of it being dark, but they wouldn't be there immediately. That's the, um, that's the difference. So, yeah, if you hear them, if you hear them immediately, then it's definitely, then it's definitely a spawner, which is really useful. Okay, I'm running around the edge of the ravine. This is not a great idea. But I do want to light up the the perimeter so that I don't... Oh, I'm getting glitches. Oh, that means it's probably time to reboot my PC. It is pretty powerful, and yet the shaders really kill it. Anyway, shaders are brutal, really, on on your computer. They, um, they're so cool looking, but oof, they, they use a lot of power. Okay, that is lit up. I feel sufficiently lit, I think. I think I'm happy with that. I think that I'm probably going to be safe tonight if I stay up here. At least relatively so. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to be relatively safe. A mob could wander in from a distance, but hopefully it would be far enough of a distance that I'd, have time, I'd hear him and have time to, uh, to react. So... Um, should be all set. We're playing a waiting game now with these melon seeds. Which isn't awesome, but it is what it is, you know? It is what it is. I am going to make a shovel, an iron shovel, because I can, um, and keep fishing, I think. I think I'm going to make a shovel and keep fishing. Um, I don't need to cook that right now, and I don't want to waste my food. All right, let's uh, let's do some fishing. When I said food, I meant coal. I don't want to waste the coal. As I look at a field of torches, a totally extraneous, a totally extravagant field of torches, but uh, you know, you gotta, you gotta, um, you gotta be extra safe sometimes. Especially since I died to mobs last time. So I'm really not gonna die to mobs. I really don't want to die to mobs. I really don't want to die to mobs. Which is kind of the only way to die in this game. <laughs> I either die to f I fall, or I, I f take fall damage, or I die to mobs. I mean, there isn't really anything else. But I really don't want to die to mobs. If I fall in the ravine like an idiot, I deserve that. That's fine. You know what? That's fine. All right. It's getting to be nighttime. I'm going to have an opportunity to test out my wall, or my, uh, my perimeter, which is very exciting. Okay, let me cook this. Let me also reboot my computer, because this is getting stupid. Okay. Hopefully, that will be a little better. So I think... I think... I'm going to stay above ground for the night. And try to... F look, the sun is a circle with a square around it. That's really silly. I think I'm going to stay above ground for the night. 
I have enough torches. I have uh, an iron sword. I have full iron armor. Um, I've got I've got some food. And just um, fight off any zombies. I would like to get some skeletons for bone meal. If I can kill some skeletons, that would be nice. Um, did it just get brighter just for a second? Oh, now it's getting... I see the black and white coming in. It's getting dark. And there's the moon. That's so pretty. It's so pretty. Oh, yeah. So there's definitely going to be mobs across the way. On that hill over there. Um, skeletons could spawn over there and shoot at me. Possibly, but... I feel like... That might be a little too far. Uh, which would be nice if it was. I don't need strings, so spiders are... Oh, don't kill the Enderman. If I fight an Enderman, I'll be a little unhappy. Yeah, let's see who my neighbors are. Now, why am I walking out of my perimeter? I don't know. I'm stupid. But, you know, I don't want to stand around the whole time. There's a zombie. Alright, well, I get to do some fighting. Now, because I have torches down, these are going to grow through the night, right? That's how that works? Where'd he go? I think that's how that works. I think... I think that's how that works. Mobs, um... Crops, if they're lit, they grow... All the time. In theory. In theory, that's true. Alright, you're dead. I got my first zombie kill here. No, it's not. I killed some. I killed one in the in the mine shaft. Okay, well, never mind then. There's his friend. That's... Well, at the very least... Um, skeletons are gonna spawn and I'll be able to go collect bones. That's true. That'll work. Um, you know what I do need that I could work on during the night is I need a lot more stone because if I'm going to be building a stone castle, I'm going to need a serious amount of stone. And I should probably build like a stone quarry like a st basically strip mine of stone so that I can get their materials for my castle so I guess I could just do that here in the middle of the field alright yeah we'll do that and wait I need a shovel too let's get a shovel and I can make iron tools. This is great. All right. Iron shovel. Got my food. Cool. I'm in good shape here. I'm going to do this in the middle of the field right here. And here we go. Dig, 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 digging time. It's digging time. So I'm going to staircase down for a little while. And then I guess... Um... I don't... I guess there's not really a point in going down this far, but... Well... I mean, I'm collecting a lot of cobble. There's not... I'm like, I'm up pretty high. I'm at Y45, so it's not like I'm going to run into diamonds or anything. Really, this is, this is just for resource gathering. Okay. Um, all this jumping is going to kill me with food.
That's boring. That's very boring. Um, do I want to do that? <laughs> I think I may have changed my mind. I don't know. I got 64 cobble. Well, I should make... Now, like I said, the the two uh, objectives for this challenge are... I mean, obviously survive. That's challenge number one. And challenge number two is to... Oh, there's a skeleton over there. I'm going to go get him. Is to build a castle with a melon farm. So we got the melons going. We got the melons going. All right, skeleton. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you without falling in. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, I got bones. Oh, I got bones and arrows. Sweet. Sweet. That's perfect. Any other skeletons out here? There's the ravine. Don't fall into the ravine. Three creep, Four creepers. That's just wonderful. I got to feel the creepers over there. Alright. I've got... How many arrows did I pick up? Where are they? Did I not get them? Is my inventory full? I didn't get the arrows. Oh, crap. I need the arrows. I need those arrows. Where was that? Here. Whew. All right, how many? Four. Better than zero. Four is definitely better than zero. You fall and die. All right. I've got bone meal now. All right, let me take care of you. But I've got bone meal. I got bones for bone meal. Um. Let's see. Eat my fish. Okay, I got bones for bone meal. Let me bone meal. And um, these melons. Sweet. So now the melons are going to grow melons, I think. I think they grow melons on each side. So, grow melons on, I don't know. We'll see what they do. And I want to bone meal some of this wheat. Because those are the, actually, I'm going to save the mel, I'm going to save this bone meal for melon seeds from the melons that grow. Because I'm going to get more melon seeds when these, uh, when I get the melons. Let's see. That was good. That was a good battle. Um, now, I should wait until daytime. Really, I should wait until daytime. And then go skeleton hunting. This is such a cool look right now. Wait, I need to just... Standing in the, in the torches... With the color vision... Hey... Standing in the torches with color vision, looking out into the the landscape that's black and white, that's so awesome. I love that. And the sun is coming up. Alright, more skeletons. These skeletons I can handle, I think. Although there's probably creepers over here. I'm sorry that you were a villager. If this was last month's challenge, I would have tried to cure you. Did I get anything anything from this guy? Probably. Probably. Okay, cool. Saw another skeleton over here, too. I thought... There he is. You die. Oh, I just ran through him. Come on. You die. You die, please. Alright, you're burning. Oh, and I got more bone meal. Or, oh, crap, wait, I, I don't have inventory space for bones. So I miss, probably missed this guy's bones. Unless he didn't drop any. Did he not drop any bones? You're a skeleton. You're made of bones. You gotta drop some bones. No? No bones. Okay, well, he made no bones about that. <laughs> 